Hey guys, it's Christella. Welcome to my channel, Fly with Stella. So basically, if you guys have seen any of my other videos, you know I've been a flight attendant now for about a year, and I have learned so much stuff about packing and what are essentials and what aren't essentials and what I absolutely need to travel with and what I can like leave behind. So I've compiled a little list or I've compiled some of my absolute must travel with items. So I'm gonna go ahead and go through all of those with you and kind of explain to you why they are amazing. If you hear <laughs> squeaking, it's my dog. He wants to play. He always wants to play when I'm filming. Okay, so first I'll go ahead and just show you. This is my carry-on bag that uh, was company issued when I um, first started as a flight attendant. So I always keep luggage tags on it because I want people to know this is mine and not yours. And it's a standard black bag and it has pockets and zippers and compartments galore. This thing can carry so much. So I just got these made, um, my personal little tag here, I got these made on Etsy and I have my crew tag as well. So I'll set that down. I took out my absolute essentials. So these things I fly with when I'm actually working and even when I'm not working. I have them both. Okay, so <laughs> this is this was in one of my other videos. Starting with the first thing, this is absolutely my most essential item. I never ever leave home without it, whether I'm traveling or not. This is my Lucas Pawpaw um, ointment. So this stuff, my brother gets it for me. Put it there so you guys can see. This stuff, my brother gets it for me in Australia, and this stuff is amazing. This is like my cure-all. I think I said in another video, it's like my Windex. If you get a broken arm, if you get a burn, if you get a scratch, if you get a bug bite, if you get anything, this stuff heals all. So I use it for my lips, I use it for my cuticles, I use it for dry spots anywhere. If anything goes wrong, I use this. If my face is dry, anything. This is my number one travel item I never leave home without. Okay, that leads right into my second must-have. It's the Burt's Bees Lemon Butter Cuticle Cream. So I fly so much and you get so dry in the plane. It smells like lemon, it's amazing. You get so dry, you absolutely need to worry about your nails and keeping your hands, uh, your cuticles moisturized. So I, and you have so much time when you're just sitting on the plane, you have like absolutely nothing to do except maybe watch movies and read you can do this. At home maybe you won't, but like, yes. So that is my second favorite thing. This is something that I bought at Sephora a few years ago. I bought a ton of them. I don't actually think they're available anymore, but I will find an alternative. So it's just, oops, it's a nail file, but it's a nail file that is in its case. So, that way it doesn't get all, it doesn't scratch everything inside your bag. You just keep it in the case and it travels so well. This is my fav, one of my favorite products in the entire world. And so I really like to keep track of my cuticles and my nails when I'm on the plane. Okay, so my next item, since I'm on this topic of nails and hands, these are something else that I travel with. Uh, you never know when you're gonna need to take your nail polish off. These are nail polish remover pads and they come, this individual pack will take off every single nail, um, will take off the polish, polish for every single nail that you have, unless you have like glitter, because I've tested it on glitter and yeah, you take like two, sometimes three, because glitter is so hard to get off. But these nail polish removers travel really, really well, because I'm always worried about my nails and I can't stick like a bottle of nail polish remover in my carry-on bag, because that's just kind of weird. So these things are awesome. They don't take up a lot of space. I just stick them in there and if I ever need a touch up or need to do something, those are there for me. Okay, the next thing that I travel with all the time is an empty water bottle. Ah! Well, this one wasn't empty. Oh my gosh. So, okay, a little bit of water spilled out. So this is, I don't know. Can you see it? BKR glass water bottles. This is my absolute favorite water bottle because it's easy to carry. Uh, when you go through security, always have it empty. And then when you get into the airport, there's tons of like places that you can fill it up with water. I've even gone to Starbucks and they'll fill it up for me for free. And it's really nice of them. 
I always get super hydrated and on the plane we give you those little glasses of water. It's never enough. So I like to stay super, super hydrated. So I always travel with one of these. I have this in purple and I also have it in hot pink. Depending on my mood and my outfit, I'll switch it out. These bottles are amazing. Okay, the next thing I fly with all the time, it's kind of something I discovered new, so I've been testing it and I really, really like it. It's my ballerina tea. So basically, when I travel, I get really bloated and I retain a lot of water. So this tea, whether I have it on the plane, if I ask for a glass of hot water, or I, again, go to the Starbucks and say, hey, can I have a glass of hot water, they'll give it to you for free. Sometimes they charge you for the cup, but most of the time they just give it to you for free. And I put my own tea bag in there and I drink it as I'm waiting for my connection flight or if I just got to the airport and I know I'm gonna be you know, bloated or retain water, I'll just drink this immediately. And you know, I don't carry the whole box. I just take a few tea bags with me depending on the day. Okay, another thing that I travel with that I absolutely love and it reminds me of home and this is just a personal sentimental thing that I travel with is this perfume. So this is Smellbent uh, Saint Trapeze. I never say that right and my fiance always gets me for it. He's like, babe, it's pronounced like this and I'm like, whatever, I love it, it's my fave. I don't care. This stuff smells like beach. It smells like sunscreen, beach, and tanning oil. And if you guys know, I'm from California originally. However, I'm not living anywhere close to there. <laughs> but this reminds me of home. It reminds me of Santa Monica, Pier, Beach. It just, it's my favorite scent in the entire world. It's 1.7 fluid ounces, so it can go with me anywhere. If I'm being nostalgic or there's someone smelling next to me on the plane, I will spray it <laughs> because it really does remind me of home and it's my absolute fave. Okay, another thing that is an absolute essential that you have to have to travel with is a snack. So this <laughs> doesn't have a label on it. This is just oatmeal. So again, I rely on Starbucks or the plain hot water. If I'm hungry and I don't really wanna eat the airplane food and I don't, you know, I'm trying to be healthy or whatnot, I will just get a cup of hot water and put my oatmeal in it and eat it because this is gonna be a much better snack than buying something on the plane or even something in the airport. You know, that food's expensive and it's filled with a lot of salt. So that's another super, super essential. Okay, so getting down to my last few things here. So, of course, you guys, a Kindle. <laughs> this is my absolute, one of my absolute favorite things to travel with and just take anywhere with me. This one is the one that lights up. So whether I'm in a plane and it's dark or I'm somewhere and it's dark, this thing will light up so I don't need another light, I don't need external lighting, whatnot, I don't have to disturb my neighbor when I turn on the overhead light, I could just use it here. This thing always entertains me, it's always there for me, it's super slim and easy to carry, so I always travel with my Kindle. That brings me to these guys. This is an absolute must. So I never really was a big like headphone person and I never really was like, you know, those things look kind of big and bulky and puffy. How do I look? <laughs> I can't hear because they're noise counseling. So these were the limited edition. Um, my mom got me these for Christmas last year and they are so, so awesome. In the plane, if somebody is being loud or noisy or there's kids crying or they're running around or I don't wanna hear the announcements, I put these guys on, I listen to music, I listen to the movie that's playing on my screen. These are so amazing. Uh, they're a teeny bit expensive, but they were worth every penny, especially since I live by by continent, <laughs> I was gonna say by coastal, but I don't live by coastal. Uh, I live in Germany and New York, so I'm always traveling back and forth. It's like a seven hour to eight hour flight leaving out of JFK. So I really need these headphones. They're awesome, I always keep them in the little travel case. They're just the Bose, you know, I don't know, noise count counseling uh, headphones. They're awesome. Okay, and this is another thing. <laughs> I have so many favorites, guys. I've tested so many of these things, and these things are awesome. So this is another one of my favorite things here. This is my um, Lululemon scarf. I forgot. 
forget what it's called. But this thing is like an all-in-one product. So it's a scarf. Also, I always get cold on the plane. So I can just undo these little things and it automatically turns into a blanket. I can put it this way and it can keep me warm. I just, I love this thing. Plus it's super chic and cool, so when I get out of the plane, if I just wanna like throw it on really quick and you know, get my jacket on and go, it's awesome. Even if it's hot in the summertime, I'm still always cold in the plane, so I just really quick, you know, fold this little guy up. Doesn't take a lot of space. Fold it into a little tiny square, put it into my carry-on, and it's multi-purpose wherever I go. So this is a must. It comes in a ton of different colors. I absolutely love it. Okay, another thing that I fly with, I got this from Fashion File. If you guys don't know about Fashion File, you need to check it out. It's so amazing. So basically, this is my Louis Vuitton Florentine Pochette, and it is a fanny pack, but it's also a little thing where I carry all, like it also doubles as a wallet. So. It doesn't fit much, it's super tiny, but I always make sure I carry, oh, I don't wanna show. I carry my license, my my cards, a little coin pouch, and my um, passport. And I put it in there so this is, when I get to my destination, I can use it as just a little wallet, a little pouch, or I can put it around me and it's my fanny pack. And it, is seriously awesome and I keep it in its little dust bag that it came with just because I don't want to scratch it or get it you know discolored or something in my bag so okay and then the last final thing that I fly with and even if I'm like not flying I take this with me everywhere I go this is one of my essentials and this is my Ruby Woo Mac red lipstick don't know if you can see it oh it might be upside down. There we go. Okay, so I'm actually wearing the Ruby Woo now. This color is just universal. And when I'm flying these seven, eight hour plane rides, you know, I don't wanna put a ton of makeup on because I'm probably gonna be sweating, I'm gonna be sleeping. I don't want my makeup all over the chair. I don't want it on my clothes. I don't want it on my neighbor. So I always just carry a red lipstick because I think red is a super chic color. It's complimentary to almost every skin color and it just really adds a pop of glamour. So if I've been flying all day and then I get to Germany and my fiance is picking me up at the airport, I don't want to go looking like a hot mess, like, hi, look who you get, look who you're marrying. No, so I'll really quickly step into the bathroom right before the plane lands or right after it lands and I'll put on a little bit of lipstick. Even if I have nothing else on, this will make me look a little fresher and make me glow, I think, a little bit when I land. It's also a great color if you know, you're know you going straight from the airport and you're going somewhere and you're immediately gonna go out, say it's a short flight, you throw a little bit of this on and it's awesome. So I know this was kind of long, but I really wanted to kind of let you guys know all of my favorite things I travel with because they're really useful. Some of these things you might not know, you might not travel all the time, maybe once or twice a year, but I literally travel you know, five to six times a month and that's multiple legs, multiple trips. Uh, and so I'm always going, so over the past year I've been perfecting what I bring with me, what is essential, what is not essential, what's gonna take up a lot of room and space and what's not, what I can do better. So I'll probably do another one of these videos in a year and I'll be like, oh my gosh, all of that stuff, no, here's all my new stuff. But for right now, that's all my essential, essential things that are awesome when you travel. So I hope this helps. If you even just take one of the things away and use it, I'm happy. So thanks again, guys. I'm Christella, and again, this is Fly with Stella.